Hi, I'm Peter Birch and today we're going down to Penrith to look at a reptile expo for the local Hawkesbury Herp Society. Come with me and let's check it out. You're watching Critic Hands. One of the most unusual things I found at this reptile show is Ravi and his feathered friends. Some magnificent animals. This is Zen, he's a wedge tail uh, He's about four and a half years of age. Uh, now, the reason why we're not 100% sure about his age is because when Zen first came in, he came in as a wild eagle that was pleasing. Uh, Tenanium, which is a fox bait. Uh, it's used to control foxes and feral dogs. Yep. Uh, these guys feed a lot of roadkill, like carry-on. He ate some of that and he was poisoned. He got a little bit of neurological dysfunction through his rehabilitation and training. Um, he, came, he came great. He came he really good. He built an incredible blind. Unfortunately for Zan, he can't be released. That's because of the poisoning. He's come a long way and he's a part of our amazing show. He's an absolutely spectacular animal. And these guys are actually the apex predator in Australia for birds? Yeah, yeah for sure. They're our number one aerial apex predator. These guys can see uh, newspaper, newspaper print 10 foot. About 2.5 kilometers away. He can be up in the top of the thermal, he's got optical vision, he'll shoot straight down. As long as that little mouse or that little piece of meat's moving, he'll, he'll zoom straight down uh, and go for his prey. Hitting, hitting awesome speeds. You know, and when he's going down at full speed, he's got this little dictator membrane that'll cover his eyes like a pair of glasses. Yep. Make sure the, the, the wind doesn't press his eyes so he can stay focused on his, his prey. Absolutely amazing. Thanks very much, Ravi. Pleasure, Thanks, buddy. Thanks, mate. We've got a best in show division. Let's check out some of the cool animals. We're here checking out this awesome looking blue tongue. This looks like a very, very much like a leucistic blue tongue. It's got this beautiful white patterning, absolutely no markings at all, and these beautiful black eyes. Something is going to be really awesome right here. We're here at Roger Kramer's table at Blue Tongue Morse, checking out some of these awesome blue tongues. And in fact, look at this stunning animal. It's a super hypermelanistic animal. And in fact, it's a co-dominant gene, which basically needs you only need one of these animals to produce more of them. What a magnificent creature. Look at that beautiful face. We're here with John Moston, one of the event organisers for this magnificent expo, and we're going to ask him a quick question about this show. John, can you tell us when this show started? This show started six years ago, and it was over at uh, Penrith Sports Centre. And because of the interest out in the western suburbs in Red Poles, they quickly expanded, and now we're here at Panthers. And today, I can definitely say the Hawkesbury Herb Society puts on the biggest one-day reptile show in Australia. It is absolutely a magnificent show. There are a lot of vendors and the amount of people that are streaming through the door is absolutely amazing. It's fantastic. Last year we had around 5,200 people through the door and we're aiming for five and a half plus this year. So I really hope we make that 5,500 people through the door. That's absolutely awesome, mate. You guys are running a great show. Thanks, Luke.
We're down here at Australian Wildlife Apparel, checking out some of the awesome shirts and designs they've got. In fact, we're lucky enough, we've got Farmer here. He's going to tell us a little bit of this concept. How did the concept come about, mate? Uh, I just wanted to have shirts basically to wear myself, because you couldn't find many around anywhere, especially Australian stuff. Um, so we got a couple of photos done. The next thing is sort of went to chasing other people's photos that we could put on there. It's definitely exploded. I mean, you got you got a bit of everything to cater everyone's yeah. likes. Basically, you've got pythons, you've got geckos, you've got venomous snakes, you've got birds, you've got all sorts of stuff. We hope to bring out a bit more stuff as well, not just the reptiles. So we want to get a few other animals. We've got some dingo shirts coming and things like that. Awesome. Um, and it's not just shirts. We've got the hoodies and the, the singlets. Hoodies and singlets, and you got some of these baby apparel as well. Yeah. That's pretty awesome. That's excellent. Well, if you haven't got any, get down and grab some of these cool clothing. Awesome designs, beautiful stuff. Hey, going everybody. My name is Johnny Moston. I run John's Reptile Awareness Displays. We do venomous snake training, basic and advanced course. We also do catch and release courses for people who wish to gain their catch and release license. We also do site assessments for reptiles. Uh, we also do reptile relocation. So if you've got a snake in your backyard that you need removing, give us a call and we'll come out and remove it. John's Reptile Awareness Displays, 0416 922 82. Thanks guys. We've had an absolutely awesome day down here at the Hendrick Reptile Expo. Not only seeing some absolutely amazing Australian animals, but also some really cool animals just like Rusty here, the Black Tegu. She's an absolutely beautiful animal. Don't be afraid to leave a comment below and hit us up on Facebook and Twitter. You've been watching Critter Cans.